All right, here is how we are keeping our water available for the bunnies in winter. Crawfish. Yeah, there's little shrimp, crawfish things in there. So we have a black water dish. Inside we have lined tarps and outdoor blankets, things that don't absorb water. And a black tire for the sunlight. Here's our bunny house. Here is our cute, my cute wife. <laughs> Not our cute wife, my cute yeah. wife. Okay, so there's one of our bunnies. They're California mixes. This is their little winter winter home. This is a 10 by 10 dog cage wrapped in wire. They've lived here for about eight months, but we've never done a winter with them. However, we learned on YouTube. So we figured we'd make another YouTube if people are searching the same thing we were. So there's a black tire absorbing the sunlight, insulated. And then the water dish should be black. It got down to 20, 20 degrees last night, and this has been freezing solid, or their old water dish was freezing solid every night. So we'd have to come up every day to replace it. And that was a lot of coming up here because we don't live on site yet. And so we're hoping this water dish gives us a day at least. Hey, don't fight, guys. I'll come out here so you can hear. But Okay. So we're hoping that that at least gives us a day so we don't have to be up here every single day. Here's their bunny enclosure. It's a 10 foot by 10 foot retriever dog cage lined with all the way underneath with uh, chicken wire. So nothing can crawl underneath wrapped in wire there. It's super convenient because our kids can play and be with the rabbits and we can be away from the kids for a minute. Um, it's winter time on our property. We are in the western slope of Colorado. Things are changing. It's November 12th, I think. So each day is around 20 degrees. Or each night is around 20 degrees. In the day it gets up to 35, 40 degrees. So at least for now we know the bunnies will still have water. So that's good. I think December we'll have to figure something else out or just make more frequent trips every day to come replace their water but for now this is a short-term solution so we don't have to worry about their water freezing so much last thing i forgot to mention the bobber is for disrupting surface tension it makes it harder to freeze so that's it there's our bunnies winter cage the bunnies don't need heat in the winter they do pretty good as long as they have straw to insulate themselves and they even dug a little hole they're natural diggers, but yeah, that's the bunnies. Bye, Mary. Hey, Mary. Shh, shh, shh. Well, I don't think she's going to come say goodbye.